an object moves with a velocity in feet per second at time t seconds as given by the graph. How far did the object travel from t equals zero to t equals 60 seconds? Notice looking at the graph we have the velocity or rate in feet per second along the y-axis and the time in seconds along the horizontal axis. And since we know distance equals rate times time, where for our graph we have the rate along the y-axis and the time along the horizontal axis, if we find the area under the curve above the horizontal axis between t equals zero and t equals 60, we can determine the distance traveled over this time. Which means we want to find the area of this shaded region. And because this shape is a trapezoid, we can use the area formula, area equals one half times the quantity b sub one plus b sub two times h to determine this area and therefore the distance traveled. Where b sub one and b sub two are the two bases with the length of the two parallel sides and h would be the height. Notice how these two sides are the parallel sides. So if we call this b sub one, notice how this is scaled by fours. So b sub one is equal to six. b sub two would be equal to 24. Then the height would be this length here along the horizontal axis, which would be 60. So the area of the shaded region would be A equals one half times the quantity B sub one plus B sub two, which would be six plus 24 times the height, which would be 60. So we'd have one half times 30 times 60. Well, one half times 30 would be 15. So we have 15 times 60, which is equal to 900, which means the distance traveled, which means the distance traveled would be 900 feet. We know the units would be feet because if we multiply the rate or velocity in feet per second by time in seconds, notice how the units of seconds would simplify out, leaving us with feet. I hope you found this helpful.